Hello everyone. Today I will show you the setup of Weather Autogen in my project, and my main purpose is to show you how to add tags uh, in API list. Uh, and you can focus more on developing your uh, API rather than uh, manually writing and updating documentation. Okay, let's start from my backend file in which I have three main files: Swagger Autogen, Swagger Handler, and Swagger Output JSON file. In, first of all, in Swagger Autogen, uh, I have imported Swagger Autogen package by doing npm i Swagger Autogen. And uh, in this file, we define some basic info about our documentation, title, and description. Host, and in host, our port number should match with low server port number. We include security definition to handle bearer token with base path for our API and uh, location of output file. Okay, uh, here we define base path also. Uh, it will change according to our project. Uh, uh, we here we define endpoint files also. Uh, in my project, I have all path. Uh, I have present all routes in controller v1, and uh, star star dot js will include all your endpoints files here. And uh, we have taken instance from Swagger Autogen, and uh, we will pass our output file, endpoint file, and documentation that we have written in a Swagger handler file. I have done setup for uh, Swagger UI Express, which I have imported here by installing npm i Swagger UI Express. I have used Swagger handler file in main server file for continuously serve Swagger UI. As you can see here, setup. And at the, this function, we will come later on. Uh, I have used this function in Swagger Autogen just after generating documentation file. But for now, I will show you plain documentation without tags. So I, I will comment this function and uh, uh, run this file using script which I have written in package.json. npm run swag. For that, I will show you. As you can see, to run this file, I have used script. So I can now run. Okay, now I got success. So, uh, UI. After running Swagger Autogen file using script, we got our output JSON. On UI, we can see our API list without tags. For bigger project, we need every API sorted according to our tags. So, I have achieved this by manipulating Autogen documentation. Here, in this function, uh, I have adjusted by reading output file. To group path and to overwrite file using fs file handler. I have grouped all path and used fs file handler handler to write output file overwrite output file. I will share you my GitHub link for this. You can refer my code, but for now I want to show you output on Swagger UI after uncommenting this function. Now I will run this from Autogen file again, and we can see the adjustment which I have done in this function. Again, npm run swag. As you can see, file has, has been written successfully. So on UI, we can see the change. As you can see, we got our API group in auth user, all auth user API, in sales product, all sales product API. That's it for today's video. We have successfully set up Swagger Autogen with tags. If you found this video helpful, please like. Thank you.